And we are live. Greetings, Internet. Kundes here, and let's continue our Meissner Porcelain campaign. Where we last left off, Brandenburg was fully fed to us, and uh, comes with a little coalition risk. So we're gonna try to not have a coalition kill us. And in the meantime, maybe try to find friends. Hey, Ottomans, wanna be friends? By any chance? No, they don't. That would've been nice. Because I have no reason to kill the Ottomans right now. Bravon wants a marriage. Uh, I'd rather not. Uh, I could convert Lignitz, but I would rather not right now. Where's my... Uh, oh, right, I'm uh, unseaging Koblenz. Okay, okay. It's coming back to me. I was in the middle of this uh, quite sizable war. It seems that finally things are looking up. Bohemia doesn't want to be in this war anymore. There's a few of them that are not feeling good about it. Koblenz is ours. I can go sit on uh, this guy as a result, on Berg. Which, as long as I... Uh, interesting. As long as I don't get any more aggressive expansion, this guy is going to get out of the coalition risk uh, pretty much instantly. You're working on... I don't have on subjects to improve relations on anymore anyway. So that's pointless. But maybe some outraged countries need some attention. Or, or, or not. Or not. Here we are. Um, what about Munster? Can improve his relations a little. Oh, we've pieced out uh, Constans. Excellent. A great start. I'm going to improve relations with this guy. Uh, Ulm got uh, pieced out. It's not that big a loss. Is Ulm dead? Ulm is dead. Ulm was devoured by Ingolstadt. <laughs> that is hilarious. Okay. Alright. If that is what is supposed to happen, Julich has fallen. This army still has like 100,000 manpower, which is impressive. If I want to piece out... Ooh, Commonwealth and France are down to uh, smaller numbers. Commonwealth! Let's go talk to the Commonwealth about the Prussian cores he has. That sounds like something I'm interested in. Um, victory, we've pieced up Berg. Berg will just give money. That's fine by me. Berg is no longer part of the coalition members. Uh, Regensburg was uh, disposed of. But he still exists. Is Nuremberg going to be fed to me? I hope not. I really hope not. <laughs> but I do have a claim on it. So, um, we'll see. We'll see what the AI does. I don't know if I can make it so that I don't want the land. I do want it, that's the problem, but I don't want want it, if that makes sense. Um, recall Munster for now. Can I unwant it? No, I can't. I cannot do anything other than be like, it'd be nice, I have a permanent claim on it. But I cannot unwant it entirely. Why did you stop that siege? Ottomans? What is wrong with you? I mean, plenty wrong with you because you're the Ottomans, but what is wrong? Oh, there's a battle going on up here, that's why. That's what caught your attention. Okay, I've taken uh, Nakla, which is Polish. That's fine. I'm gonna come siege Poznan now. And you will not stop me. Excellent. Now Mecklenburg is getting killed. And now, well, what is this? Oh, Hungary. Hungary clearly wants a lot of Bohemia. It's a bit of a problem, but... Danzig and Konigsberg. That is Prussia's problem. He is adorable, but not... Uh, not particularly strong, so... He needs a few more of his cores, I think. We should, we should work on that. Although that depends how this war turns out. I'm very happy that Austria is no longer carpet sieged. I'm very happy that the numbers are now massively in our favor. All it needed was for the Ottomans to stop playing with the Mamluks and come pay attention to us. That is all that we needed. And now there's like 30 Frenchmen just, you know, ruling this area. <sighs> why would you suicide Ottomans? Oh why, oh why. Oh, maybe because the Swedes are coming. But you're still attacking in bad terrain. Though with a very good general. 
Oh well. Let's get him back to take Poznan. Oh hey, we beast out Ingolstadt. Hey, he spat on back out. He spat a bunch of things back out. Hello, uh, Munich. Would Munich accept vassalization? I own one of his cores, so no. Lanschut hates me. What about Augsburg? Augsburg is uh, close, but there is distance between borders, which is a bit of a problem. Uh, Württemberg, I don't have a claim on you, so I'm not at risk of it being given to me. Poznan has fallen. Phenomenal. I can now go sit on Ostroda for Prussia. That is uh, gonna be the goal. Pomerania has coalitioned me. Oh no! Also, wait. If I improve relations with you, I can make you be friendly. Maybe. Not friendly, but at least between the changing of the year and the last three, he's gonna gain like 10 opinion of us. He's gonna go up to like 6. Which, I mean, is not enough, not nearly enough to get him out of my coalition, but. There we go. Positive opinion. Beautiful. Royal marriage has ended. Why is this so low? Uh, Pope react, positive stability, increased narrow-minded helps. Do I care about League Nets, though? I'm pretty sure I have no penalties. Uh, I don't even know. Let's look at the religious map mode. That'll help me spot it faster. League Nets, right here. Beautiful. This province is unrestful, but tolerance is on my side. It's because I have disloyal printers and a metric ton of war exhaustion right now. If it wasn't for that, I'd be fine. But, I mean, I lost so many troops. Because I was the brunt of this war. Now, everyone else in this war doesn't want to be in it anymore. Mecklenburg's a vassal, so he's stuck in it. Landshut is not a vassal. And he is... Uh, his capital has not even fallen yet. Spain has not yet kicked it in the face. Um, Great Britain has occupied Chart. Ooh, idea! Idea! Merc maintenance minus 15%. That's free money. No! We lost Britain! We have lost the Britons. That is unfortunate. Uh, the Ottomans are still high, though, so we're good. The Ottomans are very excited about it. Oh, he has revolts? Really? Oh, probably in the Mamluks. Uh, yeah, unfortunately, he has revolts in the Mamluks. That's uh, unfortunate. But... Uh, what is my war participation in this war? Major victory... Whoa! No! <laughs> Why? <laughs> Austria! <laughs> Why would you do this to me? <laughs> I didn't siege it. I didn't ask for this. Oh, that is so bad. <laughs> I'm gonna die. Oh, yeah, yeah, coalition. I know. <laughs> Uh, ouch. Okay, let's transfer this to Prussia. Oh, why would you do this? Why, oh, why would you do this, Austria? <laughs> uh, side belligerent, 28 development, just like, fed right into me, like, oh. Okay, I'm gonna try to be, like, super nice, super chill. Holy crap, Austria, why would you feed this to me? That is 270 to go. Ah, that is so bad. Ah, uh, That is just so bad. <sighs> okay. Well, we need more admin points. Decisive victory against Holland. I guess Holland was uh, balkanized a little. Mazarov has fallen. I'm assuming the Commonwealth doesn't... Oh, Commonwealth and France both don't want to be in this war anymore. Uh, see, there's a part of me that wants the four Prussian corps to be returned to Prussia so I can, like, annex him. But there's a part of me that doesn't want a lick of extra aggressive expansion after this, like, bombshell. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why would you give me Nuremberg, Austria? That is 28 development. Uh, I did not ask for this. Also, like, you're probably very... You are mad at me for feeding me the Oh, <laughs> uh, that is so ridiculous. I cannot stop laugh-crying about this. 
Why would you do this, Oscar? Oh wait, Bar. Oh, Bar is my vassal already. Good. Yeah, I have... Uh, oh, Block is ours. I'm gonna... I'm gonna keep trying to take things if it moves tax it. Oh man, I'm just like... I can't... I, I can't! Oh, 65. 104 though. White piece with uh, Verden. That's, that's fine, I guess. Coming up only feels 23. It's not, it's not as bad as I thought it would be. I mean, it's still horrible, don't get me wrong. Oh, France has taken Hamburg. That's not nice. Um, let's go sit on Varmia. Let's transfer to Prussia. Okay. Um, we are winning the league war. The three leagues are down. The call for peace just kicked in. Oh, that's not good. I'm surprised Commonwealth and France have not been pieced out yet, but uh, uh, they are of number blood. I'll lose some prestige. That's okay. Okay. Varmia, there we go. <sighs> okay. Yeah, that uh, that happened. And apparently he cannot find any idle, like, outraged country to idle over for aggressive expansion reduction. That's ridiculous. The cost just keeps getting up as my aggressive exp as my uh, war exhaustion rather goes up. My aggressive expansion is also going up, but that's not like <laughs> I didn't ask for any of this. I just had permanent claims. No, my royal marriage with Great Britain. Great Britain, let us continue our mutually beneficial friendship. Excellent. George von Habsburg. And I am an amazing Raff. The miracle of life. Ooh, that helps. Uh, that helps, but uh, it's so expensive. <laughs> it's so ridiculously expensive. Ooh, nice. These guys are schooling them out of my uh, property, as it should be. Um... Might be able to separate Peace Bohemia for positive gains, but uh, I'm not sure I want to do that. You would not accept because need at least ten war. Yeah, I don't even have war score to make demands. Apparently, narrow defeat with Sweden. Sweden was uh, ooh, Sweden was partially fed to Russia. That's uh, kind of annoying. So it means Ottomans is up against, uh, ooh, that's uh, people sieging the Ottomans. Austria's down to medium, he's, uh, he's less and less happy about it. How much war score do we have against the Commonwealth? 41, that's not a lot for demands. <sighs> I mean, I have to take Kono to make sure that all the Prussian provinces stay Prussian, but then I'll probably want to go take Krakow. The goal is to peace out the Commonwealth. Ideally, he'll get balkanized a little, but we'll see what we can uh, make happen. I will not convert that. I can still... Oh, I can almost core... Uh, I can core it! Brandenburgian peasants, or separatists, or a flavor of angry Brandenburgers has uh, revolted. Oh, hey, my maximum manpower is only 35,000, despite my ability to field like 50,000 troops. 72,000 troops, actually, which explains why, why, oh why, <laughs> I ran out of manpower. Let's go kill these rebels, and then we're going to want to be, like, ultra calm for a while, because that is way too much aggressive expansion. Uh, yeah, let's go deal with the Brandenburgians, and then uh, Krakow is next in line. An excellent initiative? Sure, we'll take it. I have a spare Diplo guy. Oh no! I wish I'd noticed like 10 days earlier. Ah, uh, that would have been better. <laughs> Too much aggressive expansion because Austria's like, yes, please! Here's all of my HRE, eat it! And I'm like, uh, 61, 73, 100. Bohemia feels 98. A bunch of the people from the war are. Ugh. Why would you feed me Nuremberg? I mean, tanks, but why? Uh, it'll fill out the state nicely, though. It's going to be worth quite a bit. 
I'm not uh, entirely useless. Oh crap, I'm paused. I'm paused because the Brandenburger is getting it. That is fine, they're done. Krakow! Let's go to Krakow. There is a. Uh, Sex Lowenberg, I keep what? Why? Feed it all to Austria, I don't care. I really, really, really don't want any more land right now. Oh, that was already entirely too much land. Okay. Um. Oh, wow, France is uh, having a terrible time of life. Recall diplomat. Well, the bar is not in the war because, well, he was pieced out of the war before I diplomatized him, but still. Ha! <sighs> Come on, peace out the common. We have 90 war score, Austria. Just, just send the demands. We have all of it. Bohemia's at low, Commonwealth's at low. Just, I mean, why are we still in Luxembourg's in this war? Why is Luxembourg in this war? Why has he not been pissed, pieced out yet? Oh, there we go. Protestant League has happened. Uh, Bohemia will cede a bunch of lands. Strasbourg becomes a vassal. Lensch becomes a vassal. Lancer really... What? Catholic becomes the official fate. Austria now owes me a bunch of favors. Okay, Prussia did not get anything. But we are now at peace. <sighs> we are at peace. And uh, my coalition is now going away because I'm allied to Austria. No longer at war with France and the Commonwealth. I've gained conquest against Austria because of course I did. I am just not ready. Oh. Yeah, my coalition is now going away properly. I can be the first in the world in uh, Diplo and military tech. An incident in the Empire. Hmm. The Swiss left the HRE. Interesting. Um. Hmm. Yeah, let's uh, let's let's Switzerland. Let's weaken the empire. I'm all for weakening the empire. Also, if I take up in both of these, I gain two innovativeness each, which is usually not great. But I'm capped in points, and I don't know what to do with them. So let's get innovativeness. Uh, Berg, that's fine. My primary army is mercenaries. Where can I bench them so they don't attrition themselves? How about my new province of Nuremberg? <laughs> Munster has left the cold. Whoa, 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 Austria, why are you angry? I like to rival? What did you rival? Oh, you rivaled Great Britain. No! Ah, uh, I need new friends. Damn it, also, is there a penalty for unlawful territory? Uh, not at the moment. You just have all of the penalties, all of them, absolutely all of them. Whoa. Uh, spend favors. Damn it, Austria. Why would you do such a foolish thing and rival Great Britain? Provence has been granted electorate. Prussia can have a marriage. Hungary being my friend. I'm okay with that right now. I assess that he's about to get murdered or something, but... Uh, I'm probably going to have to turn on Austria sooner rather than later, but... Biggest issue is the Catholic League having won. Ironic that the Catholic League featured the main Protestant member and the Protestant League featured two gigantic Catholic neighbors. Uh, superior unit types. Bunch of dudes called Maurice. That works for me. I would have given you access if I had time. I can rival. Um... Portugal rivaled me. I kind of want to rival him back. Um, I wish Russia was actually a friend. I like to rival. Who's your rival? Great Britain. Everyone hates Great Britain. I have a feeling Great Britain is not a fantastic ally. But he is a Habsburg. And uh, that is tempting. Development of veneering. Is Spain a Habsburg? Spain is also a Habsburg. Spain is also allied to Great Britain. Spain would, however, suffer from the Council of Trent. Uh, 
I hate the Council of Trends so much, I hate that it went uh, hostile. I feel severely diplomatically isolated, because Austria will stop being my friend automatically as soon as the royal marriage ends. Milan has rivaled me. I mean, okay. I can rival Portugal and Milan, I really don't care. Unless, who is Milan allied to? You're not allied to Austria? Let's make it count. Go away. And who else? All of these are great powers that I don't want to deal with. All of them. I mean, one of them is my last hope at not dying a horrible, horrible death. Uh, Truce with the Commonwealth will end in 1591. And I think I will want to attack the Commonwealth and fling Austria at them when that happens. Are you still like to France? No, you're not. Ooh, you're not. You're also allied to Lubeck and Three Leagues. Hmm. Yeah, I have... Uh, hey, I could improve relations with Nassau so he doesn't coalition me. Um... If the royal marriage with Austria lasts another year, uh, you are 51, so you need to get to at least 52. Ideally longer, of course, but you need to get to at least, like, you know, last, last another year on the throne. So that my alliance with Austria can be salvaged. I was given way too much land. Austria, why did you give me all this land? I think I finished coring Nuremberg, though. I did. It's beautiful. It is simply art that it is mine like this. But, uh, damn. And I need to break through all the way to China. The objective is still Meissner Porcelain. The objective is still to go all the way. And to do that, at this point, I'm gonna have to kill some Catholics, because Catholics are a bit of a problem. Uh, I wish people stopped being rival to Great Britain, but uh, Switzerland has left the Empire. Very good. Holy Roman Empire has, like, no uh, Imperial authority to speak of. It is going downhill fast. Oh, I'm no longer an elector also. Does that mean I'm no longer a kingdom? I am still a kingdom somehow. I did not lose my kingdom ship. Though I am not an elector anymore. Um, only six free cities because he fit me to Nuremberg. <laughs> I protect free cities except those who go against me. Those I feed to my closest allies, who I kind of hate. <sighs> this is what kin means. Okay. General Ernst Rout No, he died. That's a shame. Okay. Uh, we're almost there. We're almost at preserving... Barely our alliance with Austria. And, uh, let's see where we can take that. Nassau is, uh, oh, Bregenz has left the coalition. Is Pomerania still in it? He's still in it. He's, uh, he's still in it, though. Damn it, Pomerania. I can improve relations all the way to, like, minus five. And it'll switch by that much. Yeah, sure. Let's make that happen. The number changed, actually. Oh, because now he desires my stuff. Of course he does. Of course he's like, now I'll desire his stuff. He'll never see it coming. <sighs> okay. Alright, well. This aggressive expansion is a bit of a problem. It's surprisingly not that bad, though. I thought Munster would hit me a lot more than he currently does. Maintain with Pomerania right now. The number is going to change by... 7.7 .7. That's exactly what I want to see I mean, I'd like to see just a bit more, but we take what we can get. That is the rule Same as the uh, outreach countries guy doesn't know what to do with his life though. Oh, Austria's at plus one Spare no expenses. Okay. We have salvaged our Austrian friendship Barely, but we have <laughs> Uh Part of me is like, I should just flip back to Catholic, except that the Protestantism was a bad fad, and uh, K 
carry myself on the back of my humanism. But, um... I don't really want to deal with that implication. I have so much money. Can I do something with the money? I could probably build buildings. Still manufactories. Uh, Halle is decent for that. Workshops, none that are good. I do have a few good temples though, so we'll build them real quick. Okay. Why was I fed Braunschweig? Why? <sighs> well, it seems that uh, Bromsberg is like, Russia gets a peasant war. Can I try to improve relations with Russia? I am going to try. Because I would like to ally them. I am currently at 9 out of 6 alliances. Some of these are utterly useless, like Akin and Silly. But I'm going to keep them until some of the more egregious members of the potential coalition leave. It's not like I'm like behind in Diplotech anyway. <laughs> I generate entirely too much Diplo point, which is good for us. I very much want civil service and more governing capacity, but civil service. Uh, that's a shame for Crystal. Here's uh, bookkeeping, which I never need because I don't do the loan thing. Mercenary manpower plus 25% is going to be very good for this army, which is slowly trying to regain its manpower. Mercs regain it so slowly. But I'm very happy about this stack. It's not a good stack. It's poorly balanced. It has way too much infantry for what it is. But right now, it's the best I got. What's my force limit at? 73. I can totally afford to build a 25 stack. Let's uh, build a template for 25 stack. A properly balanced 25 stack. Basically what I had before the League War. What got uh, mercilessly destroyed. There we go, we'll call you the base 25. You were great until you ran into 100k stacks. So I'm gonna build another one. There we go. We'll have a proper army very soon. At least, uh, at least 60k troops. That's worth something. Plus our vassals, which is... Well, Prussia, do I have? Oh yeah, and Sax... Sax Lodenberg needs to be eaten. It's a bit of a waste of a vassal. Uh, technically as does Bar, but Bar still has a core. Oh, but you're allied to... Oof, you're allied to... How did you ally Russia? How did you ally Russia when Russia just... Oh, Russia loves me with a heart. <gasps> Wait. I'm allying Russia. Uh, I'll take the prestige. I will ally Russia. Oh, uh, yes. Oh, uh, yes. Russian alliance... Looking very good. That's exactly what I need. That'll, uh... That'll keep me safe. Much safer than this flimsy Austrian alliance. And the best part is I can chuck this guy at the Commonwealth. I'm sure he'll be very happy to jump in. Uh, I suspect Great Britain is going to be feeling very uneasy. Oh, there we go. Alliance breaking with Great Britain. Hey now, Great Britain. How about you don't do that? Here's some trust. There we go. Now I feel safe. And now I actually feel so safe that all the useless allies, like Silly, like they are actually like a perfect embodiment of Silly alliances. I'm gonna delete them. Because I don't need that anymore. I need my Diplo slots back. Any other one? Technically, Brabant is worthless. Well, he's less worthless than he was, but. Yeah, I can, uh, I can get rid of that. He's now uh, a little disappointed, but I need my Diplo slots. You want access, you can have access. I don't care. Are you a vassal? You're not a vassal. Somehow you're just not murdered. No problem. Refused alliance. Minus 25. I will now insult you so you break the marriage. You smell. And you're a waste of a Diplo slot. Excellent. Now give me back my Diplo slot. Maybe he won't give it back. I don't know. Austria is back to an actual positive number. Plus eight. That is a functional, at least, relationship. <laughs> not an alliance. That's not where you want your allies to be at. But at least he doesn't hate me. 
So that's a good start. On that uh, magnificent note, though, I think it's a good time to call the episode right now. So I'll thank you guys for watching, and uh, I will see you next time, where hopefully we'll look at expanding in the Commonwealth, but I think I might take uh, a little bit because of the truce. Unfortunately, truce for another 12 years, but we'll look at what we can do. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. See you next time.